What is up, Disney Nerds? Today, we are at a game room. There's really, this is the only game in here, air hockey. But we are playing some Pac-Man, because we are going to be going to Bush Gardens later. Let's go. Okay, so we are getting ready to go to Bush Gardens, Williamsburg. Um... I'll see if I can record on the ride. I don't know if I could, because a lot of them are roller coasters, and I, f quite frankly, don't want my $1,000 phone flying into the air. So, with that being said, I might do what I did for Hershey and insert some roller coasters into the video itself. I won't do as long. I'll just put, like, short clips of the roller coasters. Um, but, yeah, uh, so let's go. Okay, so we are in the parking lots. We got here at 9.50ish and the park opens at 10. So we're right in the front, which is really good because this is a big parking lot. Um, today we're gonna try to just stay in Italy because um, we're gonna come here a lot. So we're gonna try to do each section. So today is Italy. All right, we are entering. I am so excited. I've been to Bush Gardens back when I was 11, um, but I really don't really recall that time. But let's, let's see. This is definitely the world's prettiest park in my opinion. I think it looks really cool. Let's go. So down here are the entrances. Um, oh wow, over here you got like a waterfall. It's really cool, hollow screen. We're not here for hollow screen though. But yeah. All right, we are going through the security. I'm probably going off because I have a battery in my bag, but we'll see. So we are here. This is the British England area. They got a telephone booth, some fountains, really pretty. All right, we are here. This is very coolly themed. It really reminds me a lot like Epcot. They got the floors like uh, all stone. Really cool. And over here, I believe we got Big Ben. Yeah, right there. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Got the clock tower. I don't think it's Big Ben, but it's a clock tower, so it's really cool. It's like a symbolism up for Big Ben. Okay, we are leaving um, England, and now we're going into Scotland. It's going to be great. I sound Australian now. I don't know why, but Yankee Doodle, we are going into Scotland. Got to go on some Loch Ness Monster. It's gonna be great. We got the train station right here. It's pretty cool. Um, we might go on the train later, but right now we wanna head to uh, Loch Ness Monster. It's gonna be great. I'm so excited, bro. Like, I'm so excited. Right there is Griffin. I don't know if I'm gonna go on that. We'll see. Here's the Loch Ness Monster. We are, we are excited. Let's go. Mom, they're going up. They're going up. Look at that. Whoop, whoop. I'm excited. I would just like to say that all the videos being taken of POV on the roller coasters are done by Bush Gardens uh, YouTube channel. So thank you for that and enjoy the video. So just got off uh, Loch Ness. We got right on, no line. Uh, now there's a line and they're only running one train. But it was very easy, it was a bit rough. Definitely not intense at all. We just made the train, so let's look at it. Ready? Okay, so we are back in Scotland. Um, now we are going to escape from Pompeii, which is around Italy. Um, so yeah, let's go. Uh, we just went on, again, I just went on, um, Loch Ness Monster, really fun. But now we are going to get soaked. On our way to Escape from Pompeii, we see these guys. 
I don't know what they are. I think they're like some type of bull. Let's look. They are Scottish Highland cattle. Oh, cool. And over here is the Sesame Street uh, kind of place for bush gardens. It's just like, it's a kid section, but it's really cool. Pretty uh, coolly themed. Here is Escape from Pompeii. It's right here. I'm very excited for this ride. Uh, one of my favorite rides at this park. It, you don't get too bad soaks, but you definitely get, you do get soaked a little bit. So sadly, this ride is currently closed. I don't know why. Hopefully it gets back up in a short amount of time. I think it will. Um, but yeah, this is like the viewing area. Okay, so now, since this ride is currently closed, we are gonna go on Battering Ram, which is kind of like a pirate ship. Um, uh, but it's a good sign is they are just running the ride right now. It could just be because the park just opened, but hopefully it will open up. We are walking into Italy. They are playing some Italian music. It's really pretty. I really, I can already tell. There's Pompeii. We're, da we're hitting that ride today. I'm hyping up for that. It's gonna be exciting. It's gonna be a very long line, but I don't care. We're going on it. Not right now. Right now we're going on Battering Ram. So I believe it's right here. Here it is. Here is the Battering Ram. And oh, this isn't the entrance, is it? Is it? No, the entrance is over here. Okay. So far, the lines have been very short. Um, I'm sure when we get on later, it's gonna be very busy, but as of right now, it's very short. All right, we just got off the pirate ship, or battering ram. Now we're going on the flying machine. Should be a simple ride, easy. So, flying machine was really fun. This is some of the really prettyness of the park. There's a lot of butterflies in these. Mom, look, there's some butterflies. They got some statues. It's really cool. They have that thing. And there's that ride. It's kind of like a smaller version of the flying machine. It's only 11.30, I believe, or 11-ish. And this is where some of, this is Marco Polo, where we're going to eat lunch. And they're going to be doing a show here. This is where you can go and eat and watch the show. So this is Marco Polo. It's open from 11 to 6.30. And this is really cool inside. Mystery journey. They got a lot of stuff. Really pretty and beautiful inside. They have entrees, kids meals, flats, sides. It's really cool, really, really pretty. And then you can watch a show depending on the time. So we got a table. We didn't get anything yet, but it is 1114 and we wanted to make sure that we got a good view. And this is a perfect view under shade. Looks really good. So I got spaghetti without meatballs because I'm not really a fan of them. Mozzarella sticks and chocolate cake, which this looks really good. I'm interested. And a Sprite. It looks, this is really cool. All right, so we're playing this risky. We just finished lunch and now we are going on a daring ride, the Pantheon. I might be vomiting on this ride because I just ate a big lunch. But we're gonna do it. It's gonna be great. And here it is, Pantheon. I am terrified. Okay, so I went on Pantheon two times. Definitely best ride ever in history that I've ever went on. 10 times better than Sky Rush, in my opinion. I loved it. So much happened. But now we are going on Apollo's Chariot. We are getting frames um, right here. So yeah, it's gonna be real fun. So I went on Apollo's Chariot twice. It was really relaxing, honestly. Like nothing really crazy about it. Then we went on Escape from Pompeii. You didn't get soaked too bad. It's kind of like a little mist. It's very hot in the ride itself. 
But now we are going on Loch Ness Monster one more time, and then we're gonna head out for the day. But yeah. We are back in Scotland to ride Loch Ness Monster. There's a horse, looks like the horse from Brave. But yeah. So on our way out, we just got off of Loch Ness and we did front row, crazy. We're seeing some horses. This is Axel. Looks really cute, really cute. And over here, we got Aiden. He must be out somewhere. Yeah. This is Dakota. Dakota looks like the horse from Brave. Looks like Brave. Hi, Dakota. Hi. Then over here, we got Eddie. All right, we are leaving Bush Gardens for today. We'll be back here eventually. Um, but yeah, it was really fun. I got this unlimited drink thing, like how I did at Hershey. It's worth it, because I need to stay hydrated. So, we left um, Bush Gardens. We're now back at the room. Um, but I wanted to show you guys this real quick. We got this really cool frame for Pantheon with the photo. There's the frame. And obviously, as you can tell, it's really cool and like it stands up. And you can get two of these with the photo and the frame for $30. Uh, two of these uh, exact replicas. Um, but yeah, it was a really fun ride, really fun time. So yeah, I really love Bush Gardens. And I think it will be one of my favorite parks to visit. And with that being said, it's out. Peace.